Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Makbus, a traditional Kuwaiti dish made with spiced rice, meat, usually chicken or lamb, and vegetables. Makbus, also spelled makbus or makbus, is a popular dish in the Arabian Gulf region, particularly in Kuwait, Bahrain, and Qatar. It is a rice-based dish that typically includes meat, spices, and vegetables. The main ingredient of makbuz is long-grain rice, which is typically cooked with a mixture of spices, including turmeric, cumin, cardamom, cinnamon, and black pepper. The meat used in the dish can vary depending on the preference of the cook, but it is often lamb, chicken, or fish, other ingredients commonly used in makbuz include onions, tomatoes, garlic, and chili peppers. These ingredients are usually sautéed with the meat before the rice is added. The dish is then simmered over low heat until the rice is fully cooked and has absorbed all of the flavors of the meat and spices. Makbuz is often served with a side of salad, yogurt, or pickles. It is a hearty and filling dish that is perfect for sharing with family and friends, and it is a staple at many social gatherings in the Arabian Gulf region. Shawarma, thinly sliced meat, usually chicken or lamb, wrapped in a pita bread with vegetables and a variety of sauces. Shawarma is a Middle Eastern sandwich that typically consists of thinly sliced, seasoned meat, usually chicken, beef, or lamb, that is slowly roasted on a spit or vertical grill. The meat is often marinated in a blend of spices, vinegar, and oil before cooking, which gives it a distinctive flavor and tenderness. The cooked meat is then shaved off the spit or grill and served in a pita bread or wrap, along with various toppings and sauces. The toppings can vary depending on the region and personal preferences, but common ones include tomatoes, lettuce, onions, pickles, and sometimes French fries, the sauces used in shawarma are also an important part of the dish. A popular sauce is tahini, which is made from sesame seeds and has a nutty flavor. Other sauces include hummus, garlic sauce, and spicy sauces like harissa or shada. Shawarma is a popular street food in the Middle East and can also be found in many other parts of the world. It is a convenient and satisfying meal that is often eaten on the go, and it has gained a cult following among foodies around the world. Kebabs, grilled skewers of marinated meat, usually chicken or lamb, served with bread and sauces. Kebabs are a type of dish that originated in the Middle East and South Asia, but have since become popular in many parts of the world. They typically consist of small pieces of meat, vegetables, or both, that are skewered and grilled over an open flame or hot coals. The meat used in kebabs can vary widely depending on the region and the cook's preferences, but some popular options include beef, chicken, lamb, and fish. The meat is often marinated in a mixture of spices and other ingredients before being skewered and grilled, which helps to tenderize it and infuse it with flavor. Vegetable kebabs are also a popular option, particularly for vegetarians or those looking for a healthier alternative. These can include a variety of vegetables, such as bell peppers, onions, mushrooms, zucchini, and eggplant, which are skewered and grilled alongside or separately from the meat. Kebabs are often served with a variety of accompaniments, including rice, salad, bread, and dipping sauces like yogurt or hummus. They are a popular street food in many parts of the world and are also commonly served in restaurants and at outdoor gatherings like barbecues or picnics. Falafel, deep-fried chickpea patties served in a pita bread with vegetables and sauces. Falafel is a popular Middle Eastern dish that is made from ground chickpeas or fava beans, herbs, and spices. 
The mixture is shaped into small balls or patties and then deep fried until crispy on the outside and tender on the inside. Falafel is often served in a pita bread or wrap, along with various toppings and sauces. Common toppings include chopped lettuce, tomatoes, cucumbers, and onions, while sauces can range from tahini or yogurt-based sauces to spicy harissa or hot sauce. The origins of falafel are somewhat unclear, but it is believed to have originated in Egypt or Palestine and then spread throughout the Middle East and beyond. Today, it is a popular vegetarian and vegan option and can be found in many Middle Eastern restaurants and street food vendors around the world. Falafel is a versatile dish that can be enjoyed as a snack, a main course, or even as a breakfast food. It is high in protein, fiber, and complex carbohydrates, making it a nutritious and filling meal. Samosas, fried or baked pastry filled with spiced vegetables or meat. Samosas are a popular snack and appetizer that originated in the Indian subcontinent, but are now popular in many parts of the world. They are triangular or cone-shaped pastries that are typically filled with spiced potatoes, peas, and sometimes meat, such as minced lamb or chicken. The pastry shell of a samosa is made from a mixture of flour, salt, and water, which is rolled out into thin sheets and then cut into circles. A spoonful of filling is placed in the center of each circle, and then the pastry is folded over to create a triangular shape. The edges are then crimped or sealed with a flour-water mixture to keep the filling from spilling out. Samosas are traditionally deep-fried, which gives them a crispy, golden-brown exterior. They are often served with a variety of dipping sauces, such as tamarind chutney, mint chutney, or yogurt sauce. Samosas are a popular snack and street food in many parts of the world, and can also be found in Indian and Middle Eastern restaurants. They are a tasty and convenient snack that can be enjoyed on the go, and are often served as an appetizer or party food. Lukamat, deep-fried sweet dough balls drizzled with syrup or honey. Lukamat is a traditional Middle Eastern dessert that is popular in many countries in the region, including Saudi Arabia, the United Arab Emirates, and Bahrain. It is made from dough that is deep-fried until crispy on the outside and soft and fluffy on the inside, and then drizzled with a sweet syrup. The dough for lukamat is made from a mixture of flour, water, yeast, and sometimes milk, which is then formed into small balls and allowed to rise for several hours. The balls are then deep-fried until golden brown and crispy, and then immediately soaked in a sweet syrup made from sugar, water, and sometimes rose water or saffron. Wukamat can be served as a dessert or a sweet snack, and is often accompanied by Arabic coffee or tea. It is a popular food during Ramadan and other festive occasions, and is often made at home as well as sold in bakeries and street food vendors. Wukamat is a delicious and indulgent treat that is beloved by many in the Middle East and beyond. Its combination of crispy dough and sweet syrup makes it a satisfying and flavorful dessert that is sure to satisfy any sweet tooth. Foul metams, a dish made with cooked fava beans, served with olive oil, lemon, and vegetables. Foul metams is a popular breakfast dish that is enjoyed in many countries in the Middle East and North Africa, including Egypt, Sudan, and Saudi Arabia. It is made from cooked fava beans that are seasoned with garlic, lemon juice, and various herbs and spices. The fava beans used in foul metams are soaked overnight, then boiled until they are tender. The beans are then mashed or pureed with olive oil, lemon juice, garlic, and a variety of spices, such as cumin and paprika. The mixture is then heated and served hot, often garnished with fresh herbs, diced tomatoes, and a drizzle of olive oil. Foul metams is usually eaten with flatbread or pita bread, which is used to scoop up the bean mixture.
It is often accompanied by other breakfast foods, such as hard-boiled eggs, cheese, and olives. Fowl metams is a nutritious and filling breakfast dish that is high in protein, fiber, and complex carbohydrates. It is a staple food in many countries in the region and is often enjoyed as a hearty and satisfying meal to start the day. Muhalabia, a creamy dessert made with milk, sugar, and rice flour flavored with rose water or orange blossom water. Muhalabia is a traditional Middle Eastern dessert that is popular in many countries in the region, including Egypt, Lebanon, Syria, and Jordan. It is a sweet pudding made from milk, sugar, and cornstarch, which is flavored with rosewater or orange blossom water. To make muhalabia, milk is heated in a saucepan with sugar, cornstarch, and flavorings such as rosewater or orange blossom water. The mixture is stirred constantly until it thickens and becomes smooth and creamy. It is then poured into bowls or ramekins and chilled until it sets. Muhalabia can be served plain or garnished with chopped nuts, such as pistachios or almonds, or with a drizzle of honey or syrup. It is often enjoyed as a light and refreshing dessert after a heavy meal. And is also popular during Ramadan. Muhalabia is a simple yet delicious dessert that is easy to make and requires just a few basic ingredients. Its creamy texture and delicate floral flavors make it a popular treat in many Middle Eastern households, and it is often served on special occasions and celebrations.